Hello everyone, Jorge Huertas once again with all of you. Today I'm going to show you what is and how to define a need and the pyramid of Maslow. Well, this is an assessment of relevance basically, and it got the following characteristic. It is the main requirement to a development of a project with design thinking or any other agile methodology. It's very important to understand that if you want to start a business, if you want to develop a project, you have to keep in mind that you need to create something that people need. So that's why understand what a need is and of course the pyramid of Maslow will help you a lot with this. So basically what we do here is that we qualify and we uh, organize every single need and we focus on that. Before I start the explanation of this video, please subscribe to our channel, turn on the bell, give us a like, and if you want to support us and give us a super thank you, we really appreciate. Please share our content because that allows us to keep going and growing. Okay, so basically, the first thing, what is a need? A need is defined as a necessity in the state of a being in which it is lack of an element. A need is attainment result essential to live and a step of well-being. So the Maslow Pyramid is a tool that basically allowed you to understand what needs are more important than others and what kind of needs each person needs. So we basically, we got five stages. The first one and the biggest one is the physical needs or first need, which are basically the things that all people in the world need to keep alive, like eat, sleep, uh, have a place to stay. We all need to rest. We all need to breathe. So that is very, very important. So these are the basic needs and are in the first uh, step of, of this pyramid. Then we got the needs of security, which are basically we all need a work, we all need housing, we all need to uh, go to the doctor, all related to health. Pension allow us when we are old that we have keep coming an income. So these are needs that are very important as well. We also need affiliation. And affiliation is extremely important because we all people need friends, we all need affection, we need to belong to a group. So that's why people support a sport club or go to a different kind of reunions and gathering. Um, we need a couple, so it doesn't matter what your orientation is, we all need someone to care about us. And we also need we got the, the, the need of recognition, which is basically things that give us confidence, that show our success. So that's why there are awards in the world. So the people acknowledge when we are very good about something. The most important thing here is that, for example, the need of recognition, you need to be good in something or, or some people even purchase an award to, to get that feeling and and cessation. The final need is need for self-relation, uh, which is creativity, development of personal potential. It means when you start developing projects to help someone else, when your creativity really allows you to create something different. So these five steps are extremely important because when you want to develop a product, a service, a company, you need to understand which is, is the need that you are going to be focused. For example, if you want, if you are in agriculture, if you are uh, developing food, so these are physical needs, every single person needs to eat. But if, for example, you have a construction company, this is a need for security, you need ho housing. So that is very important. Why, why this tool is so relevant? is because many people create things that are not necessary, that people really don't need, I have a big impact in 
your life. So when you choose unqualified, you, you have two possible scenarios. Is your idea related to one of these specific needs and fields? If yes, you, you can continue. If no, you need to rethink what you are doing because many times the things that you want to do are not worth doing and you're going to spend a lot of money and a lot of time in something, in something that is worthless. If yes, specify, specify which, which one and why in that level. So that's very important. You say, no, it's need of recognition. I want to create an award thing. Okay, specify it. The third one, if the answer is no, write why is worth doing that, that, that venture. That is extremely important. Sometimes people just do it because they think it's a good idea, but they really don't have any support to do that. The best business always got better somehow people's life. So it's always improving that. If you develop something in some way is improving someone else's life. So that's very important. If it doesn't do it, you have to rethink that. The idea here is that when you know that your uh, company, your product or your service is working a real need, then you start to developing. But it's very important that really is related to a specific need. As a conclusion, we can say that it is essential to evaluate the necessity and relevance before to do any kind of development. The world does not need more developments that only generate pollution. The world needs solutions of actual problems, of current problems. Vanity and ego are not necessities. If you are going to do a project for those motivations, please don't let the world, we, we don't need that, and, and the world will really appreciate if you don't develop that kind of projects. Thank you so much. I hope this video was a big help in your education. Please subscribe to our channel, follow us on social media. Our Udemy courses are already available in the description of this video, you can find the link. Every Monday we have a new video in Spanish and every Thursday we have a new video in English. Thank you so much and we'll see you next time.